Okay, so uh, I'll write some exercises for uh, I'll write some exercises for computing the minima and maxima. And putting question one is find all critical numbers. And the maximum and minimum values of F on the given interval part A is F of X is x squared into x minus 4 or minus 1, 3 part b is f of x is 1 out of x into x minus 4 or 1, 3 part c is f of x is x squared into x minus 2 or negative 1, 2, part D is f of x is 1 minus times squared x on the interval minus pi by 4, pi by 4, part D is f of x is x plus 1 out of x minus 1, all squared on the interval minus 3, 0 and then finally, finally part f is f of x which is equal to x to the power 2 over 3 divided by 2 plus the cube root this is the cube root of x on the interval negative one eight. You can try to compute those. And then question two. Question two is uh, let's see be a real number. Not equal to zero, non zero. What is the relationship? What is the relationship between the critical between the critical numbers for the function for the function f? on an interval FB and those of the functions and those of the functions are defined by A of dx C of, of x B H of x is F x plus c and c kx so we can record f cx and then uh, question three question three which you can try is if F has the maximum value M on the interval AB and G has a maximum value L on 
Ebony uh, is L plus M necessarily necessarily the maximum value of H which is equal to F plus G on A B and then uh, we ask that under what conditions under what conditions will this be true of course this this uh, partly helps you to know the answer in the previous one uh, uh, and then what relationship what relationship will always hold will always hold between the maximum value H on A B and the number L plus N. And then finally, I give two questions for this exercise. So, question four. Which you can try is that uh, I find find the numbers B and C if the function f of x, which is equal to x squared plus b x plus c, has minimum value. f of 3 is equal to negative 7 on the interval 0, 5 and then lastly uh, if we let f of x be equal to x cubed minus bx uh, find a and b if f of 2 is equal to 4 is the maximum value of f and the interval 0, 4. So you can try out these numbers and then in the next class we shall continue with checking for maximum and minimum using the first derivative test.